I wanted to take this opportunity to show you the water droplet. Notice that when you spray, and you continue to spray in one spot with a fine misting bottle, that you get a bigger and bigger drop of water. So, when we're floating, we want to add little driplets of water all over, not all over, but around our palette in different sizes. Actually, just when you're painting. This is just the funnest, coolest um, technique. Now, when you're floating, what happens is your brush will dry out, okay? So what happens with these water droplets, if you watch very carefully, you can watch it suck up into the brush. All right, if you make this noise, it does it even quicker. So we've got, we're floating along. I'm going to load my brush. I'm going to blend into some black. I guess that's black green. And if I was floating on a piece of paper, it's going to dry up fairly quickly. If I wanted to continue floating, I could suck up a little couple droplets, blend on my palette in the same spot, and then keep floating and floating. Blend on my palette again. Keep get a little dry, suck up a water drop, blend on my palette. You'll notice that your float gets prettier and prettier and prettier as you do this. Okay, so you don't have to get into your water, you're not cleaning your brush. Okay, you get a prettier float. This is also an excellent um, way, say you are Gonna, maybe you want to do a little wash of paint. Suck up a drop of water right there on your palette and you can really control how much water you add to something. Okay, So that's another good way of getting um, some control.